Hey guys, so a new series on Friday came out on Netflix called Man vs. B, starring Rowan Atkinson. So the last thing I saw him in was Johnny English Strikes Again, which was absolutely hilarious. Like the whole franchise is a must watch, especially anybody who wants a bit of a funny movie to watch. So it was actually sort of great to see him in a new project because that came out years ago. But yeah, so the series is a comedy. I mean, it's got to be a comedy, right? It's about a man who finds himself at war with a bee while house-sitting a luxurious mansion. And so, who will win? And what irreparable damage will be done in the process? So, here is Grace's and my non-spoiler review. But before we begin, please remember to give this video a like if you like our review on the series and subscribe to the debate cut. Oh, on to our review. So what I liked about it, because, you know, sometimes we get these really long episodes and you're like, oh, my God. But these were like mini bite episodes. So like literally like the first one is like just under 20 minutes and then the rest were just under 10 minutes, which is absolutely perfect, especially if you don't want something that's going to take too long. And you mm -hmm. can literally just watch it once, like one a day or something. And, you know, it's pretty good. Yeah, yeah I mean, I mean, the main thing we got to talk about is the show right it's absolutely hilarious it's it's really funny like instantly when i saw the actor i instantly knew it, it was going to be a comedy or something because yeah. he's done um mr bean he's done johnny english and um he's he's done a lot of funny show funny characters and this one yeah he's really great in this in this show yeah. Uh, there's not a moment where I haven't laughed or smiled <laughs> it's really good yeah no I've laughed till my stomach ached and I was like oh my god I need to take a break like I can't <laughs> but uh, yeah, yeah he, he's absolutely brilliant in this and it's 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 because you know a lot of shows you get more than one person you know having to share that limelight but he was really like center of this because mm. this whole show is about him so, you know, they have to be really good. And he was absolutely brilliant. I mean, I can't think of a time that he wasn't great. Mm. But yeah, he was he was really good. Yeah. And the story is so simple. It's just a man mm -hmm. trying to go up against a bee. <laughs> and yeah, it's it's strangely good in a way. Like it's just, I thought, what kind of random idea is that? But it's actually <laughs> really good. Yeah. And you never thought, like, there's so many disasters happen in each episode. And it's like, oh, no. <laughs> but it's, like, funny at the same time. <laughs> yeah. Because, yeah, yeah, I mean, like, you just, um, it's, it's, it's just hilarious the way they do it. And, um, yeah, it's, it's just good. I mean, it's, you may think it's like, it's very odd, but it's actually really good to watch. Yeah. And it would definitely make you watch just even one episode. If you just watch one of the episodes and you just, it, it just highlights your day, really. Yeah, definitely. It's something that will just cheer you up. Mm. Something. Yeah. yeah. Especially like, like Grace just mentioned, like the only plot is that Trevor is against a B and that is literally, and then all of the stuff that happens because yeah. he's trying to get rid of that bee. And so mm. that's literally the whole story. And that yeah. just sounds really I'm boring. Me. I'm going there. I'm going there. That's brilliant. Yeah, I'm going there. I was like chewing on the bee for <laughs> just, just a little bit for not getting whack by a Oh, okay. Or, oh, yeah. Like, not getting like, like burn up in flames or anything. I'm just like, it's just a bee. Calm down. Yeah, that was one yeah. persistent bee. He would he wouldn't stop. He like kept coming and coming and coming. I was like, this bee obviously just loves Trevor. Like, yeah, and uh, yeah, it's probably like uh, I don't know karma or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <clears throat> yeah. It's yeah, it's really good. It's yeah, yeah, and. I would recommend it mm -hmm. and it's like Emily said it the episodes are short so you, there's nothing much of all there's not like complex like twists or plot mm -hmm. turns or anything it's just easy to follow and it's easy to watch and it's that like, it's good it's family friendly mm -hmm. and I do like that add a bit of story to this character because yeah 
yeah it's, that was nice it's, it, yeah it was really sweet and lovely yeah because we got to yeah. see like a different side even though it was a comedy there was also something a bit more deeper like a mm. father and his daughter and like yeah the issues there but yeah it's actually sort of maybe a bit wary of like getting house sitters to see yeah. and like watch yeah, my house because yeah like I'm not at that point or anything but it's a bit scary like what on earth would they do while you're away <laughs> So this show yeah, really made I me would think worry. about that. I would definitely worry if yeah. someone was something after my house and I was just thinking, like, what is going to happen? Like, like, are, like, what if they took out the fridge or something or the <laughs> chandelier? And yeah. I come back and find the house wrecked. I mean, like, yeah. oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm going there. I did find a little bit unbelievable thing like because Trevor's meant to be a dad and his daughter is like 13 I didn't know if he was a bit too old but uh, I mean that's just me but yeah I mean he did I love that I had a family theme in it along Mm -hmm. the way yeah along with the man and there's also I was just gonna say there is a twist in the end which is good I I didn't see that coming and I love that I love when you don't see something coming and it happens Mm. and you're like whoa what just mm. happened you know yeah so that was good I mean I did suspect something in the beginning but I never knew it was something like that in the end but it's really yeah. good I sort, My... of that. I sort of lie that there wasn't many just there was only one twist but it's a good twist yeah I was just gonna say my favorite scene. You probably would have seen this in the trailer. Was the shower scene, which sounds so weird, but it was, it was just so funny. Like he's just like you know, do 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 do, and then all of a sudden, yeah. oh no, the yeah. bees there. Yeah. Did you did you have a favorite one, Grace? Or oh god, I don't want to spoil anything, but it's just like and and anything with the bees, like um, <laughs> just like I think um. Um, I think I just love the one where like Trevor's just like I think in this trailer where he just goes just got so angry he's like why are you doing this I mean he's just like whacking and whacking and there's also the dog in the episodes in mo- all the episodes and yeah. I'll go be honest the dog did get <laughs> oh I feel bad for the dog in some episodes you see why because I feel like <laughs> The yeah. dog got in the middle, like when I feel like Trevor almost had the bee, the dog somehow ends up being the one game. <laughs> and yeah. You just have to dog, see the dog of you. So if you really love dogs, <laughs> like uh, yeah, yeah, just be aware, dog lovers and all dogs who watch this as well. <laughs> just be oh, aware. They're like, it's the last time. <laughs> hmm. So yeah, it was <sighs> definitely really good. And like Grace yeah. said before, yeah. highly recommend it. Mm. The one thing I did kind of like, like something a bit different was um like someone who's like, because I, I seen a lot of films and I study them. But um one thing I did like is that like um we see like kind of like the fly on the wall camera, like camera view of like, we get the feel of like the bee flying around. I thought yeah. that's quite good. But the that way they good. kind of style it, I keep thinking like, the someone made that like that bee as like a a machine bee that's spying on Trevor, or is it just like a <laughs> bee or the bee? I don't know. It's just I felt that way. It felt like like some. It felt like a fly on the wall, like a mechanic fly spying on people. I felt like I thought it was something like that, but it was just a normal bee, yeah. a regular bee torturing a man, going insane, <laughs> smashing the house. <sighs> but it's 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 funny it's really great like you got the actor who did Mr Bean what more can you ask for to make a very hilarious show it's it's yeah. great yeah so guys that was our honest review on the recent tv show Man vs Speed if you haven't seen it please watch it we highly recommend it and now before you leave please make sure you like subscribe and hit that notification bell please leave a comment down below on your thoughts on the show and what was your favorite moment 
and um, check our other review, reviews on TV shows such as Lucifer, Wyona, or our reaction videos to um, Once Upon a Time. And check out our social accounts such as um, Twitter or Instagram and check our websites that tells us, um, tells you about information about us. And um, we, so that's our end. We could just buzz off now and go to bed and we will see you next time. <laughs> So I just had to say it. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye.